It's a story, it's a short one, called The Nurse, and it's supposed to be in modern. Um, a girl had just finished nursing school and started working in a new hospital. Although she loved her job at, as a nurse, she found it difficult to get along with people she worked with. They were mostly young doctors who had just finished medical school. The problem was that they delighted um, in pulling pranks on each other. She found it very dif difficult to live with them in the residence next to the hospital because they stayed up late at night and made too much noise. The nurse worked very long hours and needed all the sleep she could get. Whenever she complained about their behavior, the mischievous doctors just laughed in her face and told her to shut her fat mouth. The nurse eventually had to report the young doctors to the hospital manager, and they got in all sorts of trouble. The doctors began to really hate the nurse, and spent days devising a plan to get revenge on her. Finally, one of the doctors came up with a really sick prank they could play on the nurse, and the doctors uh, gleefully agreed to help. That night, they broke into the monastery, uh, um, broke into the mortuary in the hospital basement and sawed the arm off a corpse. Then they sneaked into the nurse's bedroom and put the, uh, the severed arm under her uh, bed, cloths, uh, bed clothes. They placed it at the bottom of the bed so that when she lay down her feet would touch it. Chuckling to themselves they stood around in the hallway waiting for the young nurse to go to bed. As the girl went to her be bedroom, the doctors had to stop themselves from laughing out loud. The nurse was suspicious of their behavior, but she was too tired to care and went into the bedroom, closing the door behind her. The men waiting impatiently in the hallway for the nurse to find the severed arm in her bed, but nothing happened. There were no screams, no angry yells, only silence. After a while, the doctors got fed up waiting around and decided to turn in for the night. They assumed that they had placed the severed arms, uh, arm too far down in the bed and the nurse must, have felt, uh, must not have felt it. The next morning, when they wake, uh, woke up, the doctors went to check on the nurse. Receiving no answer, when they knocked on her door, they turned the handle and went inside. The room seemed to be completely empty. The doctors searched the nurse's bedroom, and when they opened her closet, they were greeted by a horrible sight. The nurse was curled up in the corner of the closet, her hair had turned completely white, her eyes were rolled back in her head and she had gone totally insane. Her face looked like it had aged 20 years, and worst of all, she was chewing on the severed arm. Ooh, cry! <laughs>